By the time the year 1914 comes around, Griffith is truly, if not at the top of his game, very close to it. He's looking for a big story to tell. It was a friend who told him about an amazingly popular novel that was written a few years earlier called The Klansman by a writer named Thomas Dixon. The Klansman was a massive bestseller. It is that book that eventually is made into a stage play and a drama. It even caused some riots and mob protests. The play on which Birth of a Nation was based, The Klansman, had produced race riots. I mean, there was a precedent for being concerned about this particular story. When Dixon and Griffith finally meet in New York City in 1909, that book has been a massive bestseller, a very popular stage play, and it is not only a celebration of the Ku Klux Klan as this noble crusade to save the South and the country, it is a viciously racist, violent advocacy of doing whatever it takes to hold black people down, to thwart their intentions, and when they get out of their place, to kill them.